hello there welcome back so now in this model we are going to learn our very first CSS image filter and that will be grayscale okay so in this uh, model we are going to convert all these images in gray but before that let's tweak little bit this navbar okay so first of all let's change brand name and here drop down so use icon okay so now you can see I'm in here in the bootstrap component you can see and uh, I want to use so this icon okay so copy it and go here and you can see drop down just rush it and actually I will also want to just you know delete this one this carrot okay and paste it here and now you can see how it's look like this is really cool okay and here's a link so and brand name let's change it now brand will be uh, CSS3 this is really awesome okay and uh, link will be well let's make it in image so I just go here and for home uh, let's search it here okay fine already you can see here okay so just copy it here and type a span glass and paste it okay and close it okay so now you can see now how it's look like boom this is really awesome okay so this is home and this is your uh, drop down menu so let's actually separate this okay so gray scale will be go here okay so let's make it uh, so make it a folder that is called filters okay so in your filter folder let's create a file they're called uh, grayscale.html okay go to index.html and copy all this stuff okay and paste it into the grayscale so you can see here uh, here's um, ahrf okay so this is home so let's uh, put index.html okay so for, for that uh, let's go up folder and index.html you can see here okay and let's make uh, this is a grayscale page okay so go above so you can just go here and make it up okay and now it's done okay so let's add it uh, here so first of all let's go here and make it and make it grayscale that is gray scale and it linked with gray scale.html okay so now you can see here so go here and if you click here you can see grayscale link okay so actually I can't see that uh, that heading so uh, maybe probably I have done the mistake and where it is so maybe in okay fine here is I actually I didn't just uh, put it a parent folder okay you can see now it's parent so that's why and now if I just visit you can see now it's looking cool so let's uh, apply our very first CSS image filter that is grayscale okay so for that uh, you can see I added a class into uh, this uh, page so you can see this is a grayscale page so that's why I put a grayscale class okay so let's visit our uh, style sheet and here just add a comment that is gray grayscale page okay and let's apply a class so gray sorry it's gray scale and all images and apply filter and that will be filter grayscale okay and put here one one means fully okay but before that let's apply prefixes that is webkit okay webkit filter and actually this is uh, considered as just as still this is considered experimental property so that's why we apply prefixes okay so webkit for uh, safari and uh, chrome okay so let's once again put here grayscale one and one for moz okay and apply filter that would be grayscale one okay so now you can see your page here and boom 
<laughs> it's totally grey now. <laughs> well, let's make a, uh, it uh, uh, like visible, fully color uh, when we hover over that. Okay, so dot grayscale. Okay, it's grayscale image on hover. Let's save us some time. Okay, so copy it and paste it here and make it zero. Okay, and now you can see if I just go here and just hover over it, you can see it's now fully color. This is really awesome. And what if you just uh, play with this? Well, let me show you. What if you want a 0.5 put 0.5 value? It's mean 50% gray scale. And when you go here, you can see how it looks like. You can see, whoa, this is really awesome, right? Wow. <laughs> no one can imagine we can just do this with CSS, right? So this is how you convert your all images into grayscale just by adding only single CSS image filter that is grayscale. Okay. So go and just apply of uh, some values like 20%, 30%, 40%, 50% that fit your needs, okay? And this is how you do grayscale okay so this is really a very very awesome <laughs> okay so now let's add uh, our image here okay to so look at uh, very awesome so let's grab this one okay for that just uh, I'm going to just uh, use my uh, keyboard to print the screen and I open and now you can see I'm going to just crop it You can see I cropped it and making it resize it to almost uh, it's 50 okay and now you can see this is very small size okay so I visit desktop I visit uh, my system image folder directory and images I type here gray dot ping okay it's gray dot ping and save it and close it and now here in grayscale HTML, I just go here and you can see here's the grayscale. Just I remove it, okay. And and here I put image SRC source, and now you can see go up one folder and images, and I go for gray, okay. Gray.png first one, and here I just add gray, and now you see, refresh it and see. If you click here boom it's gray this is really awesome okay so we are actually going to add all those blur effect and all those uh, CSS image filters okay so now you can see this is gray okay so thank you so much and see you in the next model